welcome. I'd like to hand the session over to you. Uh, thank you. Uh, good afternoon, all. Uh, so, welcome to the workshop series of uh, uh, image processing, right? So, first, let's uh, jump straight to the uh, 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 installation of OpenCV. So, OpenCV is the library used for uh, image processing, right? Along with Python. So you have to, so prerequisite pre for this uh, workshop piece is to have a basic knowledge of Python, right? You, you, should, you should have basic knowledge of Python and uh, uh, you should be able to, you should, you should be installed, you should be, you should install uh, OpenCV uh, in your computer. Uh, so let's show, let's uh, jump into installation. Uh, so <clears throat> to install open CV, uh, you should issue the command pip install. Open CV dash Python, right? So this will install Open CV in your system, right? Uh, so you can install uh, via this 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 command. Also, you need uh, if you install NumPy. NumPy also you has, has to be installed because NumPy is the uh, NumPy is NumPy is uh, used along with Open CV. So when we when some sometimes we need a NumPy array for our uh, code codes. So for that we need to install NumPy as well. Uh, so install these two. So if you are in Anaconda, there is a nice uh, nice channel for OpenCV. Uh, OpenCV conduct code. You can install OpenCV in, in Conda uh, using this link. Either I, I one using one of these one of these links. So I install using this link. Uh, this way also you can install uh, Anaconda. Sorry, uh, OpenCV. Uh, yeah. So that's the installation part. Uh, so this is a heavy package. Uh, it it comes with uh, uh, optional packages and dependencies uh, required for uh, our, our, our workshop series. But, so it takes some 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 times. So I recommend you. To, so if you are installing OpenCV now, I recommend you to install uh, using uh, uh, install OpenCV dash Python, right? So. Yeah, so this session will be, uh, so the, our coding session will be done in using uh, uh, PyCharm IDE. So you can use your own IDE for this. So I prefer to use PyCharm. So now I am in PyCharm, right? So if you successfully install OpenCV, uh, you should be able to import, import CV2. CV2 is the uh, library for uh, library uh, in library of the Apon CV. Uh, just run this and see whether you can import it successfully. Uh, so in my case, it is in plan successfully. Uh, so make sure this import CV2 works. Uh, yeah, so so if you have any uh, question, uh, feel free to uh, 
post them into chat or, 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 or unmute and unmute and ask the question. So we have met, we have you uh, so so for this practical so this uh, workshop so you need some uh, materials. Uh, these are the images and videos that I am going to use during the workshop. So I may made the uh, zip file. I'll share this uh, in, in the chat. Just download it. Uh, now I am posting it into the chat. So let's talk about uh, what's the image actually, right? So images, uh, so I let me open this one. Uh, so this is an image, right? Uh, how this image is, uh, how is the, how is the uh, uh, structure of the image? What is the, uh, what is the structure of the image? How, how image is made, right? Uh, so image is made with, made with pixels, something called as pixels. So consider these boxes as pixels, right? Boxes as pixels. And uh, so, so an image is a, an image is nothing but matrix, right? It's a matrix. So, mat, so it, this this is a color image. So, color image has three channels, right? These are the channels: red channel, green channel, blue channel, right? So, uh, uh, a picture has a resolution associated with it. What is mean by, what is the meaning of resolution, right? Resolution is nothing but, uh, let me show you uh, uh, one picture. So this picture, if you, if you right click and copy this picture, uh, then it will pop up uh, the detail of the properties of the picture, right? Uh, go to the details, then, then here you have uh, the resolution, width and the height, width and the height in terms of pixels, right? So this this image is hundred pixel width, we uh, are wide in, in wide, and three hundred and forty nine in height, right? So this is known as resolution. Uh, so so. Uh, So this image, so this is the height, the pi is height, 10 is width, right? So resolution is, uh, resolution is given in, first, first given, given, given as height comma, sorry, width comma height. So in this, in this case, 10 comma phi is the resolution, right? 10 comma phi is the resolution. Uh, but uh, when it comes to matrix, so it, it is five by ten matrix, right? Ten ten comma five uh, the image with the ten comma five resolution produce five five by ten, five by ten by three actually, five by ten by three matrix, right? So so let's let's. Uh, Let's check this, check whether this is true, right? So in my IDE, so first, so let's, let's uh, open the image using OpenCV. Uh, for that, we have to write a variable image equal. So this is an umpire array actually. Uh, image is an umpire array. Uh, so cv2 dot in read. In read is the function used to 
uh, read the read the image from a local drive right uh, so here you have to enter the file path so so i am so my script is in this folder this folder day1.py folder so my image my uh, uh, required image the image that i am going to open is car.jpg so it should it is in the same folder uh, in as as my code this right uh, so car.jpg uh, so card so pycharm uh, actually it is very intelligent so it uh, suggests me the file name so card.jpg card.jpg then so then then so the image is successfully import open then uh, let's view the shape of this array shape means shape is nothing but the dimension of the array so let, let's print this out so that we can see what's in it let's run it so this is three for 349 349 600 by 3 see uh, 349 by 600 by 3 matrix so let's see whether it is true so properties here details image width is 600 pixel image height is 349 uh, so so we get 349 600 right so first first uh, first in, in 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 matrix notation uh, first it gives uh, the first dimension gives number uh, the the height the second dimension second term in the dimension gives uh, with with and uh, the last new last term gives the dimension so height comma width comma channels right so there are three channels right so that's what i uh, depicted here right depicted here uh, so so but there is a problem here what is that so uh, so this this is so I, I downloaded this picture from the from google uh, so it says matlab rgb matrix right in matlab this is okay red, red, red channel green channel blue channel right but in image process sorry sorry in in, in open cv uh, first uh, blue then green then red pgr not rgb it is pgr in open cv the image channels are pgr the the, the order is pgr not rgb keep it in your mind uh, so so let's uh, let's visualize uh, let's uh, see this image we can see this image using cv2 cv2 dot in show in show then you have to give the window name window name i'll give a image come on the the array array is image the image is image img 
So let's run this. Before before run this, I have to write one more, uh, two more lines. Cv two dot weight key zero. Weight key zero is nothing but it it waits until I, until user press a key keyboard key right. Uh, it waits until a user press a key right. So this zero means. Uh, I'll I'll tell you what this zero means. Uh, CV two dot next CV two dot destroy all windows, right? So this means so we so we are reading the image into an numpy array called img. Then this image is visualized, shown, right? Then it wait until the user press a key. And once the user press the key, the image should should uh, disappear. The window should be destroyed. That's what that's the meaning of this. Destroy all windows. It destroy all the windows, right? So let's run this. So this is the this is the inshow inshow. This is the result of inshow function. So cv two dot inshow. The window name is image. So this is the name image. And this is the uh, IMG. So this is the content of this IMG, right? So so it wait until user press the key, right? So you have to select this window and hit the, any 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 key on your keyboard, right? Then it will destroy that window. So that's the uh, that's the basic idea behind this code, right? Uh, so let's uh, let's view let's uh, view the anatomy of this image, right? Uh, let's let's print a single pixel of this image. Image. So I consider the zero pixel, zero zero pixel. That means the coordinate, the pixel at coordinate zero zero. So let's print this out. So I'll comment this out. Uh, let's print this. So this is the RGB value. Sorry, BGR value. Sorry, right? So blue channel, green channel. Red channel, blue, green, red, BGR, right? So, uh, so this is the first pixel, first first pixel of this image, pixel value of this image. So, so it's so it is a uh, list of it is an arrow array of numpy array of three dimension, three dimension. Right, uh, three items. Sorry, three three items. Uh, so also, I'll do some fancy thing here. Uh, image. I consider first. I'll slice this image. Zero by zero image. Zero by zero uh, uh, region of the image, right? Uh, I will make it as black. Black means zero, zero comma zero comma zero, right? So let's run this. Yeah, so uh, so you can see uh, the region of zero comma zero. Uh,
This may be that 50. Fifty means uh, oh, sorry, my bad. It should be like this. Uh, now it's okay. So this is so I'm slicing the image. Right, so the, I'm considering region of region of image. So now it should be okay. Now there is a uh, black box in uh, within the region of hundred by hundred. Right, hundred by hundred. There is a black image. Right, black box. Uh, so if you need to, so so this pixel value, I I couldn't tell you. The pixel value array between zero to two fifty five, right? Black means zero, two fifty five means five, two fifty five, two fifty five, two fifty five means white. So this will generate a this will create a white box, white box uh, in uh, new image, right? Uh, so, so 255 refers to the maximum value of the pixel. Zero refers to minimum values of value mm -hmm. of a particular pixel. So, uh, so let's exit this. Uh, I'll remove this. You can directly read your image in black and white also. You can do this by issuing uh, zero here, comma zero. So this will give you a black and white image. Right? This is known as grayscale image, right? Grayscale means black and white. So. So if you inspect the shape of this array, so let me print img dot shape. I comment this out. So it is this is a array of uh, array with two dimension, right? Not three. Earlier it was three because it is a color image. Because it was a color image, but now it's a grayscale image. Grayscale image has a single channel. So uh, we don't need to worry about a, a, a third dimension. So that's why uh, it gives 349 by 600, right? So so keep it also in your mind. Uh, so if you have any question, uh, feel free to ask. Uh, Next, next, let's see how to uh, read your webcam, right? Uh, to do that, uh, we have to create the object. I name it as cap using video capture class cv2 dot video capture class. Here you have to pass the so to access your webcam uh, so your your i think uh, i believe everyone has a webcam with you because uh, most of you i think almost all of you are using a laptop so your laptop should have a webcam 
Uh, if you don't have webcam, you have to connect uh, an external webcam. Uh, don't worry if you don't if you don't have a webcam, you can still uh, follow along with this tutor with this uh, with this uh, workshop uh, using images uh, or video. So, so I put here one. You should enter zero here, right? I should. So this is. So if you enter zero, it will read your first webcam. If you enter one, it will read your second webcam. I have two webcams, my laptop webcam, and my and I and also I have a separate webcam uh, connected to my PC. Uh, so. So I am using this webcam for this uh, tutorial. So I do I, I I give one here. You I think you should you should give zero here. Uh, then while as long as this uh, this capture object is open, that means your webcam is open. So that's the, that's what this means. Cap dot cap dot is open, so it will return whether it is true or whether it is open or not. So it generates true or false Boolean value. Then uh, uh, cap dot read. Sorry, red comma. Return value. Uh, this I'll tell you what this is, what these are. Red comma frame cap dot three. Uh, so this is where you reading your webcam webcam uh, cap dot three. So this is your webcam object. So here uh, uh, here you are reading your webcam. So it gives Two, two tuple uh, with two values, uh, return value and frame, frame, the actual frame, right? The, the image, image uh, at a particular type, right? Uh, so red value signifies, so it tells you uh, whether, whether you, whether, whether, uh, whether, uh, the frame is present or not, right? Uh, if 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 red value is true, C two dot ensure frame frame comma same as we did for the image in the previous. Case we are using again show function cv2 dot show the window name comma the the uh, image array itself uh, then else if it is false this loop should break Also, if there, there is another if, if cv2 dot wait key, I put here one, right? This, uh, I couldn't tell you about this wait key function. There is some more thing uh, which I had to tell you. Here's what I found on the web. Uh, this wait key, so here, so this one means the 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 time it uh, time it uh, wait for the uh, until the user image user user press a key, right? So it wait. So this this is this number is in millisecond. So it wait one millisecond until user uh, enter a key. Right. So previous time is zero. Right. Zero means uh, wait infinite, infinitely. Right. 
zero meets weight infinitely. If you enter here uh, 30 milliseconds, so it, it means that the, this system, so, so this system, wait until user, user press the key for a 30 minutes. So it wait for 30 minutes. 30, sorry, 30 milliseconds. 30 milliseconds, right? So wait key 30 equal odd cube. Odd cube, uh, I'll put here 27. 27 is nothing but escape the key value of escape key, the escape key, right? Uh, then break. Okay, then. So that this mean if user press enter key, if user press escape key, this loop should break, right? This loop should break, right? Then after loop is is broken, uh, cap capture object should be released. Cap release. Then this all the windows should be destroyed. Destroy all windows, right? So let's run this. So this is the uh, webcam output uh, of my right? Uh, so it waits. So so it waits uh, thirty milliseconds. Uh, each, each time it, it take it wait on 30 milliseconds until you say enter uh, 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 escape key right so if you enter escape key this will uh, the the windows will be destroyed right escape key right uh, Oh, it's a good me. Come on, I run, girl. The hammer system, we can then, yeah, make major of Denova. Dealer thirty thirty milliseconds, but I mean, no, you say you say, uh, Kiaka Kenta Kerno de Kela. It was the Ilaga. I have 30 milliseconds. 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 I User press right, so uh, so S key value of the escape key is twenty seven. So that's why I put twenty seven here. Uh, okay. If you uh, put higher millisecond, something like thousand millisecond, that means one second. So it will, so there should be a delay, right? So in your webcam feed, right? Something like this. So I'm moving here and there. So you can see it only, it only gives uh, one, one frame per second, one frame, one frame per second, right? So normally a webcam has a, so has a delay associated with it. So even if you give one millisecond here, uh, it has a associate, it has a built-in 
built in delay right oyage webcam wala thiyena delay ekak me oyage built in delay ekak me delay ekak thiyena etokota metana wala me 1 millisecond thamai denna puluwan aduma millisecond gaana kene bindu dunwath nan bindu dunwath infinitely balang inna image ekak gihila infinitely balang inna etokota user me key ekak press karana ka etokota 1 millisecond dunna hama ya 1 millisecond tha balang inna එතකොට වාර වාර හිතෙන්න ඕනේ එහෙනම් වාර මිනි සෙකන්ඩ් දුන්නහම එහෙනම් මේක වේගෙන් ප්ලේ වෙන්න එපැයි කියලා එහෙම නැහැ අ වෙබ් කැම් එකේම තියෙන ඩිලේ එක ඒ ඩිලේ එක එහෙනම් සාමාන්‍ය අපි වෙබ් කැම් එක පාවිච්චි කරන කොට මෙතන 1 මිනි සෙකන්ඩ් තමයි දෙන්නේ 30 මිනි සෙකන්ඩ් දුන්නත් කමක් නැහැ සාමාන්‍යයෙන් වීඩියෝ එක ප්ලේ මිනි සෙකන්ඩ් ගන්න सामान्य वीडियो है क्या तीन ना डिले है क्या क्या ने फ्रेम देखा कतर है तीन ना गैप पे का सो सो द थर्ड थर्टी मिली सेकंड इज़ द आइडियल गैप बिटवीन टू फ्रेम्स राइट सो सो इफ यू डाउनलोडेड माय मटेरियल्स दे आर दे आर शुड बी ए वेब वीडियो लेन डॉट एमकेवी राइट so if you have if you have a, another video you can use uh, that as well so i am using this lane.mkv file so this lane.mkv file so you can enter this lane.mkv file to this right as a string lane.mkv right so if i run this so it plays very fast right because the the delay between two frame is 1 millisecond right so if you enter 30 millisecond so it it plays fine so this is the i think it should be the ideal frame fps for this uh, video um, right so if you if you enter escape key then the loop will break and the capture object is released and videos are video cap all the windows are destroyed right so here you can i metana wata ip ekak daana puluwan onna me මම වැඩකරු ප්‍රොජෙක්ට් එක මේ ඩීඩියන් එකේ IP කැමරාව IP ඇඩ්‍රස් එකක් දාලා තිබුණ මෙතනට. එතකොට 10.220.0 වගේ IP එක දාන්න පුළුවන් මෙතනට. මෙහෙම දාන්න පුළුවන් IP කැමරාවක් මොනවද ඇක්සස් කරන්න පුළුවන්. You can even use your IP cam camera with this video capture object. Uh, I'm using this lane.mkv file. Uh, uh, then, uh, suppose if you need to uh, break this loop, if you enter the the uh, you enter the Q button in your keyboard, right? To do that. we had to use odd function odd q odd q returns the ascii value of this uh ascii value of this uh, character right so then if you run this so while q q we both itarai make a destroy window ekak hari 
කියුවේ බොහෝ විතර destroy වෙන්නේ වෙන වෙන ඊසෙ බුවා කියලා destroy වෙන්නේ නැහැ හරි There is a question, sir. Can you ex please explain the functions in the while loop? Okay. Uh, so first, we we are creating a video capture object, right? Cap object, cap uh, call cap, right? Video capture object, right? So this is where you will link your media to to this. object right so cap object then uh, as long as this cap cap object is open as long as it is open you we are performing this this uh, functions right this uh, uh, is called right uh, the first function what it gives is cap dot read cap dot read me reading reading a frame uh, reading 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 a particular frame yeah, at, the, at the at the current time right uh, cap dot read so it just reading reading the frame one one by one right so it gives two two values return value and frame value return value is the indication whether there is a frame or not right if there is no frame this red value is false right uh, if there are so this video example so what happened is so it read uh, image read this cap object uh, one one by one and and after after the after the end of this uh, video the red value is false the cap, cap dot read can no longer read any frame using this lame.mkv file so red value will be false that's why it will break the loop so so if i one here if i put one here so this will run very fast and and this and the the window was destroyed right how it destroyed was right how it was destroyed how was it destroyed right it destroyed because the red value was uh, became false red value became false right return value became false that's why this uh, call window was disappeared right so as long as there is a return value we are showing that uh, particular image as uh, in the frame in the window right as long as this return value is true uh, we are uh, if this sorry sorry if this return value is true we are showing uh, that image Uh, in uh, frame window, right? Uh, if there is no any return value, let me return. Sorry, return value is if, if the return value is four, the loop will break, and uh, also we are checking uh, if whether whether user is pressing Q here. In this case, Q. Whether user is pressing Q, right? We check whether user is pressing Q with one millisecond delay, right? Uh, if user uh, user is not uh, not is not uh, pressing any key, it will return minus one, right? Of course, uh, is not there, right? If if the user is not pressing any key within one millisecond delay, it will it will return minus one, right? 
So, minus one, right? So, so I have a question here, right? I have a question. Uh, I want Mato one user one of a key a kebu hammer window a break window a destroy Mato one him a karan a him a karan 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 mukadu with an karan on Venus come user for kargi a kebu hammer window a destroy window a him a karan mukadu with a karan on Venus come what is the change that we have to do uh, if the user press any key other than Q, right? If if user press any key, sorry, not other than Q. If you if user press any key on your keyboard, uh, on on if user press any key on its keyboard, uh, we should break the loop, right? How to do it? If you have any idea, you can post it in the chat. Uh, what is the what is the chain that I have to do in this slide? If you suppress any key, any key, right? Any key on the board, any key on the keyboard, right? If you suppress any key on the keyboard, I should be able to destroy this uh, destroy this while uh, I should be able to break this while loop and destroy the all the windows, right? So how to do it? Can someone? Yeah. Yeah, good. Very good. Uh, weight keys is not equal to one minus one. Yeah. Yeah, that's the answer. Uh, We can check if the weight key is greater than minus one. Greater than minus one. Yeah, greater than minus one. It's also, I think, it's also, it's also, it's also okay, I think. Let's see. Yeah, it's also working, I think. Yeah, it's also okay. Yeah, that's good. That's also correct. Yeah. I usually do like this. Not t equal to minus one, right? Uh, yeah. I think. Uh, I think you are okay with this C to the trade key, right? The function of this uh, basic uh, the underlying principle of this working uh, of this uh, weight key, right? Uh, okay, so if I also, um, I'm again going to read my webcam. One, I'm going to use the first webcam of Second webcam of my my. Uh, if I uh, if I need need the gray image also, I can do it like this. C two. Don't. There is a function called C V two C V T color. Here first you have to enter the image. So in my case, frame, comma, then uh, code, code me C two dot BGR to gray, right? And I'm I'm also uh, showing this gray image also, right? Gray. 
sorry, we should gray. So this is the color colored image, colored image, and this is the respective black and white image, respective grayscale image. So let's run this. Right, so this is the gray image. This is a colored image. So we, I can press any key to destroy these windows. Okay, so if this also in your mind, cv2 dot convert color. Uh, we are using this uh, in later sessions also. Suppose if you need to resize the frame given by the webcam, right? You can do it uh, by simply cap dot set set uh, three three refers to the frame width frame width. Uh, you can enter frame width. Uh, I will enter. Uh, they are there. Then I will me frame with the height to have it in the theory. Resolution like other quarter. It's a quarter. We can it can make a feed like a matter of only what are specific resolution naming balagan. The method of full mug a full HD resolution naming that pain. It's a quarter. What only kid is done. It would add to resolution naming. It can feed the gun only kid. So, we have to do this. 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 We have to do uh, webcam has supported resolution set, right? So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to resize the image given by the webcam, right? So there are a set of resolutions supported in your webcam, right? So we, we only choose such uh, resolutions. Uh, I'll enter three, four, I don't know whether this works. Let's see. There is one more question. Uh, yeah. Can you explain second variable pass to convert color? Yeah. So this variable, yeah. This variable means uh, color BGR to gray, right? Uh, that means uh, so I I first uh, in the first 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 of all I said uh, uh, first time is the, is itself I said the image in open CV is read as BGR the channel side BGR order, right? Not RGB, right? So BGR so color BGR. Uh, to gray, so this is a conversion conversion pattern, right? Order BGR to gray. So this is a flag, right? Color BGR to gray, right? So CV two dot color BGR to gray. So later we convert uh, BGR from BGR color space to uh, some different color space like HSV, right? So in that case, BGR to HSV. 
greatest way, right? So in this case, we are to gray. Gray means gray scale. So if you are if you want to convert a particular frame, particular image into gray scale image, you have to issue this flag C to dot color VGR to green, right? That's the uh, second variable passed to uh, convert color, right? Hope it is clear to you. Uh, now let's run this. Uh, let's run this. It's not, uh, it's not precise. Eh? Uh, let's bring the resolution of uh, the, the shape of this uh, frame. Frame, not shape. Seven twenty one twenty eight, right? Uh, it's been full like the uh, uh, There's one more question Can we add any color other than gray? We can add, can we add any color other than gray? No, uh, uh, no, not like that. Gray refers to gray scale, gray scale, right? Uh, only it is for black and white image. You can't use VGR to white or something. There's no such thing. VGR to red. There's no such thing, right? So. Only this set color, VGR. There are a bunch of uh, there's no such thing for VGR to red or something, right? VGR to gray mean gray scale. There are lots of uh, BGR to conversion. Uh, I haven't used all the all the all, all of them. I have I only have used BGR to gray and BGR to HSV. HSV is a different color space that we are going to uh, talk about in color color detection section. Uh, right. So Keep it in mind, gray means nothing but gray scale. Gray scale means black and white. Okay. Uh, I was seeing uh, this three means, this three means cap frame width. You can either use three or you can pass this one as well. Instead of four, four me. Sorry, see you two dot. See you two dot. Right? Frame width and frame height. Also, you can pass three and four. Three and four, right? There are a set of numbers and set of uh, flags. Associate with it. Mm. You can change the brightness also. Frame rate, right? Cap dot set. 
there is something called included capital brightness. So I can enter like 10, sorry, zero. Let's see what zero means. Zero brightness means. That means, uh, let's see what it gives. So you can enter 10 here instead of uh, cap dot cap dot cap prop uh, brightness instead of this uh, this term you can pass 10 here uh, so let's run this No change in brightness. I don't know why this takes so time. I think I just, it is said that we can adjust brightness here. I don't know why it doesn't make any change. Okay, let's comment it out. So here you can pass. Resolution and high resolution, uh, the desired resolution, right? So, one more question. Uh, repeat red. Yeah, red. Red mean red. Red. Uh, red signal. Red. Red. Red indicates whether there is a frame or not, right? So, if I pin this red. So let's let's pin this red. Return value. So let's pin this and uh, let's run this. So you can see through through is printing out right, printed out through through through. Uh, there is a frame right. Frame and frame and frame, right? If there is no frame, right, you should return false. But uh, in this case, you should, it should it it is not returning false. Uh, but uh, let's let's say let's use that uh, lane dot mk because there is no end in webcam, right? Uh, the end marks after we. Uh, after user in, enter key, right? So we run, let's run this. So through, 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 through. Ultimately, there should be false. False, right? False. This, this is the last frame. Last frame returns through, right? Last frame and it returns through. And it, uh, it then again, Continues the loop, and uh, again cap is red, red and uh, new frame is uh, null. Null frame is generated. Actually, none, 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 none type object is none type none, none, none returns here, and zero returns. Right. So if we print uh, red comma frame, red comma. Uh, I'll, I'll put like this. This, this is last frame, right? Last frame is none, none and false. 
that's how uh, this loop break loop was broken right uh, hope you got it uh, okay please so, so You uh, can change this resolution here, but uh, I'll I'll show you one more method, one method, one another method uh, to resize your image, right? Uh, other than this, you can play with this, right? Uh, you. Uh, so let's see how to resize the image. I'll comment this out. There is a method called uh, resize okay? uh, CV2 dot resize. I'll resize in this frame. Before the let's uh, First, first, so this here we have to put a tuple. Uh, it should be, uh, it should first come with width and then height. I will select 340 as width and 260 as height, right? So, so this is resize to me. This is my resize to me. Resize. Uh, Let's uh, resize, resize. There is my resize image. Uh, I, I, I haven't shown. I haven't shown. That is my resize. Ah, here. Here, here, here the resize image, right? So that's how you are resizing the image. Okay, so first you have to input the uh, frame, right? Image, then you have to enter the dimension. Uh, sorry, resolution. Resolution of the desired uh, resolution, you want resolution uh, that you want to resize. This is, this is my desired resolution. 
so the image will be resized to 340 times 260 right yeah so that's about resizing uh, Let's again uh, read that college. I'll be bit tight. Okay, so does the resize change pixels so size in millimeters? Resize uh, change pixels, right? It is uh, the value C is in pixels. So it will, uh, I can uh, resize function again, it can copy the pixel values, millimeters, millimeters. Uh, it's a resolution, it's a resolution, it's a image resolution, it's a resolution, it's a resolution, it's a resolution, it's a resolution. Then, if you can see the image, you can see the Insho ek mukadi ke lagna. Insho ek insho ek karandi me me jaga display karne ke liye karandi. Har ek ande me karna me insho ek me 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 ek generate me insho function liye. Ta C V two dot insho kama image image ke liye mandam string ya a a title liye a a window title liye image. Kama image. Image jagata by me I sorry IMG can me read karagati file like I can C V2 worrying read karagat file like I'm sure I can make a tama. Now we are going to uh, draw some lines, rectangles, circles, polygons, and also we are going to even uh, write some text on it, right? Uh, so let's see one by one. So I'll take this image as the reference. Uh, so you can use any image or you can even use black image or anything, anything, right? Uh, I'll use this image. So let's see one by one. First, let's draw a line. Draw a line. 
our line let's do it c2 dot line line then you have to put the source image which is ing then uh, the first point of this uh, line right i'll enter 100 comma 100 100 comma 100 uh, second so to to plot a line on an image we need two coordinates so these are the coordinates i am choosing right 100 comma 100 300 comma 300 these are the coordinates in 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 uh, so it should be with comma height right that's the pattern of the resolution right you should uh, uh, go 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 with that order right height uh, with comma height with comma height with comma height uh, then I'll so this is the color 255 I'll I'll a white, white line so it is 255 255 255 uh, then uh, color is color is that then thickness thickness uh, let's say uh, 15 so it is in pixel uh, thickness is in pixel uh, so let's run this This one, right? Then line at Kanda. Are you got a method of Kerala? The any hundred comma hundred made in hundred comma hundred coordinate table. Hundred comma hundred coordinate table and Patang winner. Three hundred comma three hundred coordinate table. Three hundred comma three hundred coordinate table. And you know, line in the car. Look at the part two fifty five, 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 again, white color. Either we take a mock at the Pahala. So let's see how to draw a rectangle. Draw rectangle uh, for that we have to use cv2 dot rectangle again image mukha mukha mata de mukha mata de plot karan on which on which are we going to plot right so image then uh, Rectangle like a coordinate deca green known. Are we fifty comma fifty? Diagonally here may come up in another under a pass. Second coordinate. The part part of the mama gama blue color again. BGR, what is the end? BGR blue, full blue, others are zero, green are zero, red are zero, right? Uh, blue, fully blue, fully blue, right? BGR. Uh, then uh, the thickness I'll put five. So let's run this. So here is a rectangle, right? So these are the coordinate that I selected. Hundred comma hundred. This one is hundred comma hundred. Hundred by hundred. Uh, this point is three hundred comma three hundred. Right. Uh, 
you can use any color you want, right? If I put here uh, 170, let's see what the color is. This color, right? And I'll put 150, this color. Uh, I'll keep blue, right? Uh, so that's how you are plotting a rectangle on an image. Next, let's see how to plot a polygon. Sorry, sorry. before that, uh, I have some interesting thing. If I enter minus one as thickness, let's see what will happen. As you can see, it is a filled rectangle, right? Filled rectangle. Filled rectangle, right? Minus thickness is minus one. That's, that's interesting, right? Uh, okay, so then let's draw a circle. For that, cv2 dot circle img what method I got current img. Uh, I'm gonna coordinate to see a uh, center coordinate you know? circle like a center. I got a center, a CA, you can see a panaha, you know, circle like a radius 30 degrees, you know, uh, circle like a part. BGR or fully, fully, fully red bird in general. They can feel, feel, feel curve circle left, you know. Circle like a thickness, circle. thickness, like a minus one, you know, rectangle like a minus one, you know. You took a table of meter and curran. Feel circle left, you know. So the center of the circle, so this parameter, so this is, the first parameter is the one, uh, the, 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 the image we are going to uh, plot on, right? Then the next parameter is the center of the circle. And the next parameter is the uh, uh, radius of the circle. Uh, and the, this is the color of the circle. And this is the thickness of the circle, thickness, Minus one means fully uh, fill, fill, filling, fill, uh, fill circle, right? Uh, so that's how we are drawing a circle on the image. Uh, let's see the, let's see how to draw a polygon. For oh, this, I have to import NumPy here, right? NumPy, sorry, NumPy library. Import NumPy as NP, right? Uh, we have to, we have to uh, determine the points that we are going to do, right? Uh, that we are going to draw the polygon, right? So, what are the points? So, I will uh, select these points. I'll copy and paste. NumPy array. So, it's an array of uh, coordinates, right? Uh, keep it mind. Keep it in mind that this this is height. This is width. Height. Sorry, with height, with comma height, with comma height, right? With comma height. Uh, that's how you uh, 
We find Okay, then uh, next line. C2 dot polylines. Polylines. Same as before, image. Then what are the points? Inside the bracket, inside the square bracket, we have to put the point. Points. Then uh, east cross. East cross means whether this polygon is cross or not, right? I'll put through. Through means ending starting point and ending point of this polygon is connected, right? Then the color 0, 255, 255 is my color and the thickness, thickness I, I to look at 5. So if I run this, so this is the polygon I draw, draw, right? Uh, but here you can't enter minus 1 for the thickness. It, it will give you an error. So here is this area. So I don't know how to draw a fill fill polygon in a, in in open C V. Probably there should be a way for that. Uh, so this is this is how you draw a polygon. So if this is false, the starting point and ending point is not connected right so if we run this so this is starting point and ending point is not connected okay so so i put it as true then Question is asked, what is np dot in thirty two? In thirty two means yeah, but uh, you can use u in eight or so I think wait. No, u in eight doesn't work, right? Uh, in thirty two is okay. In thirty two. In 32 mean uh, 32 bit uh, integer, right? Uh, the data type of this uh, array, right? Uh, that's that's how we uh, so the, this is the data type of this array. If, I, if we need this one, there should be error. I think. Uh, no, it's working. It's working. Uh, yeah, it is optional. Uh, but in U intake doesn't work, right? Ah, U intake can't be used. Yeah, this is not a, not a color values. No? In thirty two is working. Yeah, we can omit this one also, right? It works. So this is a data type of this number array, right? Okay. Then uh, let's let's see how to write on image. Write in text, right? Uh, write in text. Let's see font. Sorry, cv2 dot put text. What is the image 
that we are going to write on it is image then next parameter is the text that we are going to write on uh, i'll put workshop next uh, the org means uh, uh, the point where we are writing the the place we are place where we are writing the text right i'm writing on this is the top result 3 130 and the font Frontal face me, font face me, font. Font that I'm going to use is CE2. Dot. Uh, uh, there are a couple of font. Font, I will select font, uh, she, simplex. Simplex, her uh, simplex. Uh, Frontal face on font scale mean the font size. I'll put one and uh, the color of the color. I say I color of the font. I'll say green BGR thickness is two, thickness of the text is two. Right, let's run this. Right, so it is it is written in green workshop, right? So this is how uh, you are writing a text on an image. Uh, okay, those are the things that I want that I needed to cover in this in this section. If you have any question, uh, please 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 me to ask. Uh, let's talk about image addition. Right. If you don't have any question, uh, I'll move on to the next section. Yes. Uh, so there are two images. Image one and image two. This, these two images. Uh, these are in same size, right? We need images in same size for this this uh, this section. Uh, so. I'll first read these images as image one and image two, like this. Then uh, I'll perform row addition, right? So this is about image addition. Okay, so you don't need NumPy array, NumPy, NumPy library. Uh, first, First addition I am performing, no addition. No addition is nothing but image one plus image two. You can simply add this like this. So let's visualize this. I'm copying code just to make it uh, Faster. Uh, yeah, let's run this. This are this is the result, right? Kind of ugly, right? Uh, this is a raw edition. That is me. That is nothing but simply adding two two arrays. Uh, there's another addition in OpenSea. 
thing to add i'll say add thing to dot add image one comma image two i'll call uh, it as add so let's visualize this. This is the like what? Okay. So observe the difference between these two, right? Uh, this is row addition. This is the addition given in C2 library, right? Why there is a if there is a difference, right? I'll tell you uh, about this. Uh, why is that? I'll comment this out. Uh, Let's say I have a pixel, pixel value x, x, n, p. It is unit eight, uh, unit eight format. It is 250, 250. Then uh, I need the umpire here. Let's take another pixel value. Why? Since it is a pixel value, I chose u int 8, right? u int 8 me. The, the value of uh, values of values of values in the array lies between 0 to 255, right? Uh, so color values range between 0 to 255. So that's why I chose u int 8. Uh, then I'll put here 10. Uh, let's see the result of this addition x plus y There are two values, right? I mean, values they can kill. They can pass me. They are an image they can add karama, or images they can count, row addition karama, echo with the hui, normal addition karama, how we do we have one. They talk about the acre, hate to mock the girabana, make a curry. The hate to one point they got gatta, x kill a point, y kill a point. They get pixel value, you got thin, zero to two beauty five them down the block. If you have a U-Int 8, you can make a row addition, you can row addition, you can make 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 row addition, you can addition, you can make row addition, you can addition, you can make row addition, you can make addition, you can make row addition, you can make row Hatter Avi, Hatter Avi, make a two with Yaga and the Buddha, Sanka, the Tipana Sapri. Hurry, it's a quarter two thirty. Eight with a mic, two thirty Yaga and the hair. The Tipana Sap, Tama Purit Yaga and the Buddha. It will make it in the way where we are time. Then you can say, we do have in our game, Hatter, Grun, Hatter, and Hatter, my stove in. That is, name at Karam, Hatter, and my stove in. Make them a Hatter up. 
ूटर so so it produces the result it, it returns the result of the remainder of the 230 divided by 256 right uh, that's how this 4 came so how this 255 came is uh, in the in this uh, cv2 dot addition method uh, x comma y uh, to to uh, the 250 plus 10 is 230. 230 exceed 256. So 250 uh, actually 255, right? Uh, 0 to 255 we can hold on to, to 0 to 255. So the maximum value is 255. So that's why it remains at 255. So we have question. Uh, how did 230 value come 230 value come uh, sorry 230 no uh, not 230 sorry 260 260 sorry 260 right uh, 250 then 250 past 10 is 260 so 260 can be can Holding uh, can be held in uh, uh, unit eight array. So unit eight, I chose unit eight array because uh, num, uh, image image read by open CV is in unit eight array. Uh, so that's why I chose unit eight here. Uh, so if unit eight we are going to open CV ring image read, we are going to unit eight to read. That is how it is read. You intake can be data type, right? Array. Ah, so the you intake you intake can be a array ke values given to pull on zero to two fifty five actually it's right. So maximum value two fifty five. And this one is the minimum normal addition. Ah, ah, ah. And the remainder. You can two fifty six again to two two fifty five exceed करो two fifty five नो बोलूँ क्या नो बोलो you intake two fifty five exceed करो ना मैं तो two two sixty ने two sixty exceeded ने two two fifty five अरे ये तो two fifty five मुआ आगे ही ना तीन ये तो आ आ एक उत्तर है नहीं two fifty five modulus two 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 fifty six तो रे क्या तो माय आता रहा है CV2 डॉट एड्ड एक इंग करा हमें एड्ड के दिए ने मैं देखे कुछ बरा 260 260 की आगे ने बैया की आगे ब्लॉक रूम 250 एंड तो 250 250 दूंगा पर एक है मैं हम 250 भाई आ पर तो रो के तमाम मैं मैं एडिशन देखे मैंने सकते हैं इस बुल हर Mm. Next addition I am going to perform is so uh, weighted addition. Uh, add weighted. I'll call it as add weighted. Add weighted equal C V two dot add weighted. Uh, source is uh, image one. Source one is image one. Alpha alpha is the uh, uh, 
there are two values alpha and beta uh, for this uh, addition uh, image two beta gamma is a measure of light right uh, alpha beta means uh, i will tell you what is alpha beta uh, alpha mean alpha mean 0.7 times image one plus 0.3 gamma mean 0.3 0.3 plus image two right this is this is weighted weighted addition right so we are proposing uh, we are considering weight test in this case so these are the weights associated with each image so 0.7 correspond to image one 0.3 is correspond to image two, right? So, so I am showing I am showing this image weighted. Uh, so let's see the result. This is at weighted, right? That is. Uh, That's very beautiful, right? This one is, uh, it's a, it has a shadow of this uh, second second image, right? So you can play with this uh, alpha, and, alpha and beta, right? Uh, okay, so. That's about image addition. Let's talk about thresholding, right? What is seen by thresholding? Uh, for that, I'm going to use this book page.jpg image. So it is uh, it is very uh, darker image, right? Dark image. Uh, there is a variable uh, so this is very interesting, right? We can't read this one, right? But using way processing, we can make it read, right? Right? So uh, so yeah, we can't we can't we can't see actually. Let's see how to read this one, right? Using thresholding, we can do this. Okay, so So I'm going to read the image, image equal cv2 dot ing and the uh, image name, the path for the image. Uh, I have book page uh, dot and uh, let's have the gray version of it, gray. We need before before performing uh, thresholding, we have to uh, convert it into gray scale, right? Gray scale. We can use color thresholding also, but uh, it is not uh, useful. So, so, so we are using black and white image, right? So, seeing two dot. CT color image that we are going to change the color space. Then the code code is nothing but as as I told before, BGR to gray, BGR to gray, right? So C two dot. Let's visualize this. C2 dot in show. 
Euh, original. Image. And then copy paste in uh, original and gray version, right? Uh, let's on this. Uh, oh, I couldn't uh, issue eight key on eight key. You to do destroy my windows. Yeah, this uh, these are the output. Still, we can't reach, but uh, let's see. Uh, The next performance is showing, right? Uh, let come on. Threshold. Special special so equal CV2 dot special you have to pass the gray image here, gray and uh, the value. The value I'm going to put is 10. So since this is a darker image dark image uh, so we have to use a low value for threshold right uh, threshold 255 is the maximum value uh, more this type is cv2 dot fresh binary right uh, i'll i'll tell i'll explain what 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 are these parameters uh, So let's run this. So this is the output, right? Uh, so we can see clearly. Uh, but still, we can clear some of the uh, some of the characters. But uh, this is the output. Uh, threshold, right? Threshold, right? So this is a binary image actually, right? It is fully white or fully black, right? It, the values of this array can have either zero or 255, right? It is called binary image, right? Me array ka tiye ne pula zero or 255 itra hai. Me by threshold karam. So kote ekai me. Ah, itar me 255. Key in a time within a two fifty five within then one maximum value. Make a upper bound. Low bound is zero than a coma. May value with an event of a damn mother with an event of a media. My make a wind taking corona mathematical FXY in an ape image. Image a pixel uh, image a f now. XY can be coordinates. Right? If, if, if uh, 
पिक्सर वैल्यू एक इमेज दिख रही है पिक्सर वैल्यू एक क्या नादास करना है माँग एफएक्स वाई कर देंगे तो वो एफएक्स वाई विशाल है ना विशाल है ना दहाई रोड है दहाई रोड है विशाल है ना return ahar wala vishala ina return karanna one ahar wala vishala nan 255 else ahar else nam binduwa metana me daapu 255 da metana me thiyen and so this is what happening underline the threshold right so if a particular point of your image suppose it is fx5 it is greater than if it is greater than 10 the value resultant value will be 255 otherwise it should be zero so this is happening this is what happens in uh, simple basic threshold right there are some other thresholding as well we will talk them in later uh, in next right uh, so this is what happen in simple threshold right Uh, pixel uh, consider f x y as a pixel value. If it is greater than ten, ten is the one I am selecting here. If it is greater than ten, return two fifty five. Otherwise, return zero. Right. So, so this is a binary image. Right. Zero. Either it can be either zero or two fifty five. उटारेस्टिंग how the, the how this binary image is change according to the value given into this position right so we can do it like this we need to create a track bar for that right so i'm going to show you a demo right uh, of what is happening underlined here right so track bar is nothing but this slide is right slide so you have a volume blocker in your in your laptop In your in, in, in the in the sorry uh, in, in, I I mean the uh, uh, volume slider. There yeah, is a slider to change the volume in software, right? Uh, so so you can use such such kind of implementation for this. Uh, for that uh, we have to use track bar, track bars, right? Track bars. So let's see how to do it. Uh, for this, I'm going to uh, we have to get a name window, right? So we do the name window, name window. I'll call it as type box. This is a window. Right, with the name uh, title, title, right? Uh, title last tag bar. So inside this tag bar window, I have to create. Uh, tag bar, right? Theme to the create tag bar, create tag bar. So here you have to specify the window, window. 
So we tagba name, right? Tagba name is uh, tagba name, right? Tagba name I will show, I will select that to show. To show. Then uh, window name. Window name is tag bus. We have what we have created here, tag bus. Tag bus. Tag bus. Then, uh, then what is the parameter? Uh, then, the, then the default value, right? Default value I will show is just zero. Uh, then the maximum value should be 255, right? Zero to do this, this value can be, so I'm creating the tag bar for this value. So it, it, it is, it lies from zero to 255. So that's why I put 255 here. Then, then we have to, so when the, when, so when this event happened, when the changing of the sidebar happened, there should be a function to call, right? This function should be written here. Uh, I'll, so I, I don't need any function for this. So I, I'll put uh, empty function. Empty. I don't need any uh, event, any function to happen. Uh, so I'll say as pass, right? I'm creating this just a dummy, dummy function. So I'll call in this function when, when, when there is a change in the tag bus. So empty. You have to write the function name, right? Okay, so that's how we create a track bar. Then, uh, then what I'm going to do is, uh, Inside the infinite loop while room infinite infinite loop uh, I'll put test t c two dot get tag bar plus you will understand this eventually don't worry right uh, tag bar name is uh, tag bar name is threshold Window name is tag bus. Tag bus, right? So then I'm going to come uh, reading this one. Now I'm going to cut and paste this one here wait threshold so here i'm going to select use t here t and uh, i'm going to show the insho also uh, this one will be I have to change the instantaneous change. I have to view the instantaneous change of the image, right? Okay, so let's run this. Before that, I have to terminate. There's a condition. There should be a condition to terminate this loop. 
so for that we do the wait wait key one like this okay so let's run this so this is the result of the session right so this is a fully white image let's see what will happen when we are increasing the show right as you can see you can see the you can see the change what i'm going to what i'm doing right If you are increasing, so it will be vanish, right? Ultimately, right? So for the dark image, the threshold value will be very low, right? So so to read this uh, clearly, I think ten is good, right? Uh, Eight, eight. So you can play with this value, right? So eight, uh, eight. Me bad to pay, na. Me bad to pay, na. So what? Now 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 what? The high. The high is not on the value. The high is not on the value. Name, name, uh, name, 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 then we so now we can uh, see somewhat clear right but still we can't clear we can see this side right so for so the concept of so the idea behind this tag bar is this one right this is a slider slider as as you change your volume uh, uh, just as you change your volume in your computer so this is a slider uh, so first what i did was i created a window window name as tag bar so this is an window name with tag bars right tag bar so uh, then i created a tag bar so window 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 name is tag bus. Uh, the 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 tag bar I created inside this window is tag is called threshold. So this is the tag bar tag bar name threshold threshold and and the window name is tag bus. Tag bus is a window name. Then uh, zero means the default value. So when I start this uh, if I run this again. If I break this, uh, if I run this again, so this is default value will be zero. So this is, that's what I put here, zero. Then the maximum value will be two will be five. Yeah, but yeah, you see, the two fifty five is the maximum, value, right? Uh, okay, so empty mean when whenever we run, whenever we did your change. To this tag bar, there, there is a function to call, right? 
that this is the function that I'm I'm calling. I don't need any specific things to do. So that's why I, that's why I uh, uh, define it as pass, right? Just a dummy, 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 dummy function. Make any come over the other way, dummy function, yeah. But I mean, make a make a value trigger can over the way. Buy a slide can over the good function, yeah. But I mean, no, no, make him wrong, make a make a pass. Sorry, it's a good thing. You can dummy function. डिटेक्शन the track bus again, I do a now uh, what I'm going to do is uh, there is another threshold in technique called. Uh, adaptive threshold, adaptive threshold, right? Uh, adaptive threshold. So, in simple threshold, the global value of threshold. That means global value of threshold means this t value is the, the value uh, that I'm going to use to threshold, right? So, this global value of threshold was used, which remained constant throughout, right? So, it is a constant. So this t value is constant. This uh, track bar, the value given by this track bar, is constant, right? Uh, so I am remove this track bar. So I want to know that uh, it is seven. So I delete this track bars. I don't need this anymore. Uh, I remove this. So I will select as seven. So seven is my global value. So if we run this, so this is the result. So so this this is the global value of the threshold, right? So this is the so this this was given constant to us, right? So so constant threshold value won't help in the case of variable lighting conditions, right? In different areas. So if there is a variable lighting condition in different areas, this threshold is not good at all, right? Because uh, in variable lighting condition, uh, the, the, the threshold value has to be varied, right? Uh, so, so make a make a Aduru photo a king. You can take a deep tank or a cake a lighting condition that the other make 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 from a may simple to show you make a simple to show you can a simple to show you make a I chicker under I chicker under the technique at the end. So for that adaptive thresholding is the the method where the threshold value is calculated for smaller regions. Okay, so this leads to different threshold values for different regions with respect to the change in lighting condition. So we use CV2 dot adaptive threshold for this, right? So, so let's see CV2 dot adaptive threshold. Adaptive threshold. Uh, for that, uh, Adaptive. I'll call it as adaptive. 
adaptive glucose C two dot adaptive threshold. Uh, we have passed gray here. Gray. Uh, maximum value will be two fifty five. Adaptive method. There are there are some adaptive method. So I'm going to use C two dot adapt. And then do this Gaussian C. Gaussian C. C then then the threshold type C two dot thresh thresh binary binary binary. And the block size, I'm selecting as one one hundred and fifteen, and the C E V one, C E V one, uh, adaptive to show, adaptive, adaptive, adaptive. So let's run this. Where is my adaptive? This is the adaptive result in this aspect. So it is very clear, right? Uh, other than this, right? Other than uh, threshold, simple threshold, adaptive threshold is uh, very much clear, right? Uh, These are the parameters to play with, right? The one hundred and fifteen, and you you can use drag bar for this for this for this same case, but I'm going I'm not going to use drag uh, bars for this now, as the time uh, flies. Uh, so this is the this is how this is this is the shorting method mode. Then this is the. Adaptive vision, adaptive type, right? So we can refer to this uh, later. C two to adaptive vision. So you can. There is a theory. It is more simple theory. You can understand uh, theory uh, if you go through it. So I have some links. I will post them. Uh, so I have plan to create a uh, notebook. I buy the notebook, uh, uh, including all the exercises I did. I am doing this. Uh, I'm doing in this uh, workshop, right? In that uh, workbook, uh, I will post the the all the theories regarding to each uh, functions. So don't worry about it. So, so that's about thresholding. Uh, So since we are we have good knowledge in threshold, so let's have a, uh, a cool thing, uh, which is this one. So I have image like this, right? So and the image also like this, right? So when I add these two images, I'm going to superimpose this image on this image. Um, so the result will be like this, right? How to do it, right? That's what we are going to see, right? So as you can see, this this black parts are filled with this with this image, right? So so this is a result of threshold. So let's see uh, how to op obtain this one. Uh, This is very easy. Uh, just a couple of coding. Uh, so I have two. So in my directory, I have two images. 
Khanud JPG and Logorod JPG, right? I'm going to use these two images. Okay, so after that, I'm going to use this, these two images, Khanud JPG and Logorod PNG. But here, first I'm going to use this Khanud JPG and Logorod JPG. Logorod JPG has black background. Uh, logo of PNG has white background. Uh, let's see how to do this. To do that, uh, so let's uh, first read logo file. C2 dot in read logo dot JPG. Logo of JPG and uh, image is this is, a, this is a background image C two dot with card of JPG right so Pause, columns, channels. No go to shape. No go to shape. No go, no go has three, three, uh, no go to shape returns a tuple with uh, number of rows, number of columns, and number of channels. Right? So I'm, I so I have written number of rows and number of columns. So I need for need these for uh, this super super uh, score position. Uh, uh, so let's see the region of interest. Region of image. Region of image is ROI. Image zero colon rows zero colon holes. This is the region of image. What is mean by that? Because my region of image can want to use. And later may let me result take a one. Then we make a result take a duhama, what a pair of my logo in a high color in the middle. You can make a box take a more in a high color. You talk about me. You talk about the ROI, the mummy, my day, the running mission, me boxing. Yeah, me, I'm taking a look at me of way boxing. You can a boxing, I'm a ROI. Region of image. It's what I get an operation make a run. ಹರಿದಾವೆವಾದ್ಯಕ್ಕೆ the logo again, logo again, rose columns, the Mangati logo again, me may image, hurry, may image. You took the image the rose columns that the uh, rose columns are in size quality. You can only region a that. Hurry, you must say. Presholding karan na kani image gray scale karan. Hari to regular mo convert color gan logo gray.
Mana logo yang kita main tersebut kerana terus ini na logo yang kita main mana kerana ni dia skin. Alah biji atau beri. Hari. लोगों के लिए कमांग पिन कर रहा हूँ मैं विचुराइज कर रहा हूँ बारे Ini kau yang ni si screen ni kat dia ni. Maka tanya logo orang grey, logo orang grey ni, kan? Logo ni, logo ni grey scale ni, kan? Hari ni, hari itu kata next time I'm going to do is. Threshold, right? Threshold in this gray gray image. Good. Mask. So I'm going to call it as mask. So we will have we will have this intuition of mask after this session. Threshold. Logo view. I'm going to use ten as the global value, and two fifty five as the maximum value. Type as the thing to the fresh binary. Fresh binary means as I said before. Fresh binary means. So if I recall that uh, the sorting technique, if if it's somehow y greater than ten, 
You sure? Two fifty five. Yes. Here. So C two dot test binary means the comparison operator is in this way, right? If you see the binary in the binary in this comparison will be like this, like this, right? Like this. So, so in this case, I'm going to use this one, uh, it is just binary, just binary, and uh, I'm going to delete this. Uh, So I have created mass. So, so I need the inverted mass also. Inverted mass, right? Mass in equal C2 dot bitwise not bitwise not. So this is an not operation of this mass. So you will see, you will, you will understand what are these. Uh, after visualization, after I visualize uh, all these things, let me visualize. Uh, mass, mass, mass in. Mm -hmm. The less on this, this is harder to move around, right? Okay, so this is the and this is the I can't see window name also. Uh, this is the this is the binary uh, binary in mass inversion mass in and uh, this is the mass. This is the mass in mass in right. Uh, as you can see, the may make a background like a part of the city part of the original like a value original value. I'll I'll show I'll show uh, original as well, original image as well, original logo as well. Uh, yeah. 
logo. This is a by uh, grayscale image. Uh, this is the original image. This is the uh, mining in image. So you can see uh, the background of this image has become white, right? This is the binary inversion image, right? Make a my binary no matter binary in kill had that may mask here. Uh, a background is a good foreground is a good one. Foreground is a good one. Foreground is a good part of it. Background is a good part of it. I need to take a mask. I need to take a mask. I need to take a mask. I made that thing again. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I Make a original image, logo ekka. Make a base image, make a mask, make a make a make a illa make a illa foreground take foreground take to the part of the background take for the Mask inversion take a canic pet. Mask inversion take a make a palvera background is with you. Make a falvela background to do it. It's an organic pet. Deep voice not taking away name. What happens in deep voice not is turning background into uh, white color. Uh, and foreground into black color. So these masks are used to do this operation, right? So, first logo, logo gray, mask, mask in, right? These are the uh, uh, masks that we are needing, that we are needing, right? Uh, Let's do the addition. Uh, Foreground C2 dot deep face and deep face and uh, logo. You have to pass the same 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 image again. Logo comma again logo uh, mask equal mask. I'll tell you what will happen in this code. Background equal C2 root big plus N. Uh, this one is ROI. ROI. 
Mas Dindi, Mas Dindi. Hai. Hai. Visualize this FG and diagram. FG, FG. BG, BG. Let's see what, what, what has happened, right? Uh, If G has become this this one, right? If G will be uh, black in the background will be black, the program will be in color, right? Uh, BG will be uh, background will be the background of the origin uh, the IMG, right? The region of interest R one. And uh, again, we're going to be in it. Uh, 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 the logo is going to be a scale caramel. Grayscale Karla, Maske Karagata. Where Maske Karagana make zero two fifty five anything, two fifty five again, maximum mega, zero can minimum mega. There are zero two fifty five in a Maske Agata. Make a end operation like a down. Nathic, logo I got it. Logo I got the end operation in the ma make my end. End operation like any monkey and Mask a logo a guy. Mask a logo a guy. And make it. Make a mask a guy. And operation will end. And operation will end me zero two beauty five in Eva. Two beauty five in the angle of the color stick him of in zero in a color stick zero will end. Black will end. And make it make it a mask a logo a guy mask a enter Hamia. अंदर के पेंडा नहीं दिया क्या है इनका मुंह पर आने लगा है मुकद्दर ने मतलब एक 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 कोई का पार बैंड नंबर ना ले सी इधर देखना मैं लोगो एक है मास्क के कल एंड लाती हूँ एंड ना हम बैंड नहीं एंड ऑपरेशन के दिन ना हम बैंड नहीं लोगो एक है मास्क के मास्क के 
white the other time. Logo ek pen na. Logo ek white region ne kada pen na. Me region ne kada hai. Aaj bhi ye to karta hai. Mass in inversion ne kya meka ganne? Meka ganne aro ayi ka. Kya mang pen na? Aro ayi ka me meka logo ka mangani karam na. वैटी गलवेदी गल
Next, uh, I'm going to uh, talk about the uh, direction. Uh, So I copy and paste this uh, reading can feed code, right? Uh, so if I run this, Okay, then uh, that's what I'm going to do is uh, the direction, right? So, So it is equal cv2 dot canny. So as time flies, uh, I just copy and paste this code. Uh, I just equal uh, canny. See, so so this function is called canny. So we, we call this canny a detection, right? So here uh, we have to give the special values, and uh, we can't remember what are these names, uh, parameter names. Uh, T two dot can threshold one and threshold two, right? You can play with these values uh, using drag bars. So for this purpose, I'm uh, choose one fifty and two hundred. So let's visualize this uh, uh, can. Mm -hmm. And just run this. So these are the, this is the image uh, that I'm going on uh, and I'm receiving. Uh, as you can see, uh, so you can play with these numbers. Uh, so that's all for today. Next today uh, and uh, and the next tomorrow, uh, I would like to talk about vast perspective. Vast perspective in uh, uh, vast perspective. I uh, I will tell you tomorrow. Yeah, perspective color direction. Topological transformation, shape detection, phase detection, contours, all, all, all of this will be, um, will be touched tomorrow. So, so, so let's, let's move tomorrow. Yeah. So, thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, so, uh, this is the end of the today's session. Uh, so, uh, there is another uh, workshop for uh, batches 21, 21st batch and 22nd batch. So uh, guys, please join that uh, session without a delay since it starts now at 6 p.m. Uh, thank you for joining us today. Uh, and please join uh, with us tomorrow also uh, for the second day of this session. Thank you.